All right, looking back through Ephesians uh, chapter 1, I just want to look at this again where it just says, Even as He chose us in Him before the foundation of the world, that we should be holy and blameless before Him. In love He predestined us for adoption to Himself as sons through Jesus Christ, according to the purpose of His will. And verse 6, To the praise of His glorious grace with which He has blessed us in the Beloved. Now there's a few things here that are certainly worth noting, but I want to just focus in on verse 6 where it just says, To the praise of His glorious grace with which He has blessed us in the Beloved. Let's look at the Beloved talking about Jesus. Look, our grace that we have is in Jesus. Grace is undeserved. I, often it has been just simply defined as unmerited favor, which is true, but I think it falls short uh, of the full intention of what grace is. And grace is favor, but it's with a function. It restores us to the place where we failed, to the place or just before where we failed. So it's like God through Christ gives you this second chance to go back and do the first thing where you failed. So whatever it was where you failed, God's going to bring you back to a place to allow you to try again, but this time with the reliance upon Him and the strength that He gives. I mean, think about the Garden of Eden where Adam and Eve failed. They were expelled. They were exiled uh, from that uh, from that place of intimacy, from that place of perfection, but in Christ, um, where He has chosen us, He has predestined us to adoption and has blessed us with His grace. We're going to have an opportunity to face some things again, but this time we can face it with reliance, with faithfulness, with confidence that He will give us everything we need. It's just like with Paul. When he wanted removal of the situation he was in, the thorn in the flesh, instead, Jesus spoke to him and said, my grace is sufficient for you. So rejoice today in the fact that you have been chosen. God loves you. He sees you. He knows where you are. He has predestined you to adoption, to restore that intimate relationship. And he has blessed you with amazing grace.